Hi nature boys and girls, this is Lady Flora and I wanted to do something a little bit different today. Um, my good friend on YouTube, Illy Mitch, has been talking a lot about a very interesting and unusual fruit and that is called dragon fruit. And I told her that if I ever saw one at the store, I would get it and try it out. And so I saw some the other day. And here it is, dragon fruit. Now these um, seem to grow on a cactus. And it's a really unusual looking cactus. It seems like it has a little bit of a trunk and then it just sort of has like spaghetti arms that kind of go everywhere. And um, it's kind of interesting looking, it's really cool. I'm not sure if I would actually grow it in my yard personally because I have this thing where I want all of my plants to be something that I can like hug or something that like <laughs> if people were like romping through the yard and they like happen to crash into it then it wouldn't hurt them. Okay, so let's see if I can do this with one hand. This dragon fruit was pretty soft, so I deemed it ripe. It's a little bit, a um, little bit yielding when I gave it some pressure with my fingers, and they were two for a dollar. Whoa, is that cool or what? <laughs> so that is the amazing inside of the dragon fruit. So this is not my first time tasting a dragon fruit. I recently tasted dragon fruit at the exotic fruit tasting event that I went to, which was really cool. And I did a video about it and I will post it in the description below. Um, but this is my second time tasting a dragon fruit. And I'm very excited to see if it tastes different. I think I'm going to have to taste it again. It's very mild. It has a very mild flavor and it kind of melts in your mouth a little bit. I had this in the fridge so it's very cold and refreshing which is nice. It's about 89 degrees today. The seeds are fun. Um, I can't describe what it tastes like. It has a very mild taste, like so mild, almost to be slightly, I'm not gonna say it's bland, not tart. Okay, maybe it's a tiny bit tart. It's not bitter. And maybe a tiny bit sweet. So yeah, it's very interesting. I was expecting something, something that went more with the look of the fruit. Something that looked more pink and green and exotic and <laughs> I don't know. It's sort of um, underwhelming, I guess, <laughs> but, uh, I'm certainly, I certainly don't dislike it, or I would definitely eat it, and I would definitely recommend it. It's very fun. I'm sure my daughter will enjoy eating this. I'm sure kids of all ages will enjoy it, and it's very cool, and it's very cool that you can grow this gorgeous looking fruit in your own yard very exotic, very interesting. Yeah. So thank you, Illy Mick, for introducing me to this really interesting fruit. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I make about four or five videos a week, Monday through Friday, approximately. 
And I believe that going outside and getting in touch with nature can give you a sense of clarity and calm that is healing and refreshing. So I will see you tomorrow, but only if you subscribe. In the meantime, go outside and have a sublime day.